Hello internet, so today we're going to make another quick VCDS video. Um, today is for educational purposes only and I'm going to show you how to disable and enable certain lights on your cluster. So at the moment this car is my girlfriend's uh, Polo and uh, she has the brake pad warning light on. Now I've checked the actual pads themselves um, and they, they're not worn but I'm going to show you how to turn that light off or other lights on the actual cluster so let's load up VCDS now I wouldn't recommend doing this this is again only for educational purposes to see how to actually do it so Okay, so what we want to do is we want to go into option 17, instruments. We want to click that. Now, once uh, we've connected, we'll see all these series of green lights here. And we need to click recode. Okay. So it will show the list of options. And what we need to do is we need to go on to this top one here so for example brake pad warning light yes so that says plus one so we change that to a two and click do it there we are the light's gone off I don't know if you saw that in the video I'm gonna try and get a quick video on my phone there if we click recode there we go so if I pull it back on, so we have 01441, okay, if we change that one there to a 2 and click recode, it goes off. Now remember, that's come on for a reason, so check your pads, don't just do this, so I'm actually going to pull it back on, click recode uh, 01. There we are, the lights come back on. Okay, so thank you for watching. That's um, a quick video showing how to actually disable the brake pad warning light if you need to. Now remember, that permanently disables the actual light. It doesn't fix the problem. So always fix the problem. And I've gone ahead and put the light back on to um, tell me that I need to do something about it. But... Thank you for watching and hopefully that helped.